Wait, who is it? That's Joe Diffie that you just asked me to turn down. I don't know who that is. Oh my. <laughs> Very exciting day. We're almost at Bath and Body Works. And this is Kristen's first time, I believe, at Bath and Body Works. Since I was like 11 or something, yeah. I even called ahead and I was like, hey, do y'all got the goods or not? She was like, well, what are you looking for? I was like, girl, I just need to know if you have fall candles. That's all. She should have known. We need she to know. She should have known. Yeah, and so the soap. We need the soap. Oh, yeah, we need the soap. How about the body wash? Do you just do the candles? And um, the So their body wash scents usually are different, you'll see. But I did look online and they had quite a few. And I think that they're on sale. I think that mm. the candles are still $14.99. I want to rub some flannel on my body. If you guys didn't <laughs> see the last vlog, she was like, if Amanda didn't put you on the soap, the flannel, and I'm like, the what? <laughs> so yeah, we're, we're almost there right now. Oh, there's a world market over here. Oh, cool. I wonder if it's I open. I want to go in there. Yeah, I'm down to go in there. Furniture. If they're open. We're here. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Look at the fall bakery. I can already smell it and we just walked in. Oh She's vlogging. I'm vlogging. We're, we're double <laughs> vlogging. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. So they're not doing shopping bags. They're doing like, I don't even get them out. This is like We're doing like these little bags. We're going to need like a hundred of these. Oh my God. Okay, you want me to put your candle thing on there? Yeah, look, this is what we're doing right now. That's how we're shopping. Okay. okay, okay. I'm not gonna be able to vlog under this at the same time, so I'll show you guys no. like afterwards what we're gonna get. Did it, y'all. Kristen got two bags. <laughs> um, I only got one bag because I really didn't need that much, but I did get like three candles that I ran out of. And um, they have like this new, I'll show you guys in a little bit, but they had some cute new, oh collections. Amanda was talking about this on TikTok and I just had it and I had an orgasm in the parking lot and it's cussed out loud. It was it's the best. It's really good. Let's it's like a diptych. I'm gonna It's like a what? A diptych where like you see a picture within a picture within a mm, picture. Mm, mm. <laughs> oh how good is that? Ice chai with pumpkin cream cold foam. I used to get, best. That's so good. I used to get the strawberries and cream like smoothie type one. I never had that one. Um, what did I get again? Salted mocha caramel. Salted caramel mocha? Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. It's pretty good. I usually drink this like once a week because, you know, the cream probably does have a lot of mm. calories and a lot of sugar. Oh, yeah. I'm hungry though. We we have to We're eat. gonna yeah, let's go find some more to eat. We made it. We're here. We have arrived. I don't think they're ready for us, honestly. <laughs> I've never seen oh my TJ gosh, Max why is it zoomed? Oh, because I just zoomed in. <laughs> she cute. All right, we're going to Home Goods. Let's do this. I'm so excited. Now that you said pillows, I'm like, that's like, like on my pillows. radar. Fall pillows. Okay, so we just came to the front. These gold things are kind of cool. Mm -hmm. I'm really into like matte decor. Oh, I like those decor. I literally don't need any more vases. I like those with the twigs, the little candles. Oh, those are cute. Those are cute. Those are super cute. Yeah, I like that. Only 20 bucks. Oh, I have, so the ones I have out on my patio are the, they have these little guys, but they're like the more like rounded ones. Actually, oh. those would look really oh. good on my patio. Those I are super cute. Also, the candles are right around here. I want to look at those candles I got last time. Those are cute. I wish there was one like a like slightly smaller than this, because it, or like what, about, what do you those think Those are about? cute. Two that are like the same, the same size, is that weird? No, it's okay. not weird. Mine are the same size. Okay. I put them out on the patio. Those are cute. Oh my gosh, the candles. I know I okay, need candles girl, them, those, I know we don't need candles, but this brand was super inexpensive and good. If I can find it. Look at these crushed lavender. Oh wow, that smells amazing. It smells really good. This is natural gate shadow box. I was like, why is it 60 bucks? But apparently it's oh, like, it's like actual stone. Actual stone. Cool. Yeah, that's kind of cool. They have some cool pieces. I need some good artwork. That's kind of cute. Aspen, I got more candles. Aspen, where is she? A oh, come, look. I got the candles. Do you want to smell them? The Aspen smell test. Oh, babe, you're going to love this candle. This is a pumpkin one, but it smells like very musky. Smell this. Just smell test, just smell. Oh, I like that one. That one's good. Oh, well, I didn't like that one. That one's good. I got this one because we ran out fresh fall morning. That one, we're almost out. Hell oh, yes. Wow. Smell test. Do you like it? Molly Lee. Oh, that one's good. 
Oh man, oh my gosh, this stuff smells so good. This is Zen Garden Essential Oil Mist. It's so fresh. I got it for like pillows and linens. And then also, I got this is a new one, Stargazing Meditation Lotion. It smells also delicious. It's cuddle weather. It's so rainy outside. I don't want to do anything, but I'm going to go work out right now because I'm going to get like a quick pump. Uh, maybe do some hydro massage and then come back and get ready to work. But I literally don't want to do anything today, y'all. I'm so just out of it today. And it's weird because it's cold, but it's also not that cold. I wore a hoodie yesterday and it was actually really hot. So let's kill this workout. Maybe I'll do an espresso shot of my pre-workout. Just got back from getting groceries. It's really cold now. I've got my like fuzzy teddy on. Rafael's finishing bringing all the groceries in. So I was gonna show you guys some stuff that we got. Um, I got tomatoes. I got lots of like veggies and stuff. So I got cherry tomatoes and the like big ones looked so good today. Got some onions that we're going to season with some potatoes that we got. Um, we've been like cutting the potatoes and baking them with like meat or whatever else around. So good. Um, we got some shaved steak. Rafael likes to make these in sandwiches. Oh my gosh, these look so good. These are like my cheat. I noticed this weekend, I was like, we don't have any like pizzas in the freezer. So I got two pizzas for the freezer for like movie nights or the weekend, you know, you just want to chill. Got some more avocados because we are out. We've been eating a lot of avocados. I can literally eat an avocado every day just by like scooping it with a spoon with Himalayan salt and pepper and lemon, so good. Speaking of lemons, got lemons. This I've mentioned before, it's the best butter. It's the avocado oil plant-based butter. It tastes just like regular butter, it's so good. Um, Rafael got his favorite coffee creamer, which is this the coconut cream. He hasn't found it since we moved here. So he got that for his hot coffee. Oh, and I'm excited to try this. I got the Ready Whip non-dairy almond milk. I saw this and I was like, hello. And it has less than one gram of sugar, one carb, zero sodium, 10 calories. So I'm gonna try this on top of coffee or maybe even like on top of hot chocolate. Um, I got strawberries. Okay, yo, these were three for $5. And I talked to the guy that was like stocking. He said that they're always out, so they're good. And LA could never compete with that price point. Strawberries were so expensive there. Okay, what else did I get? We got some chips for the theater upstairs because we don't have like any snacks. Um, so we got like sun chips, these new lime jalapeno chips and some sweet southern barbecue heat chips and we got bread for avocado toast we got some more waterloo i just got watermelon this time it's my favorite sparkling water and i got a little thing of topo chico i had topo chico when i was in mexico earlier this year and i really like the lime they didn't have it but i got the plain one so if you guys ever see this it's like very very sparkling so i like these for when if my stomach's ever feeling upset or i'm just feeling like you know, like I need something to settle my stomach. I love Topo Chico. So I think I'm gonna shower now and I think I'm gonna make a little iced coffee. Um, one of my friends sent me some hazelnut coffee beans. They're like soaked in hazelnut oil and they're oh, phenomenal. Also stopped by Whole Foods. I really just needed acai, but they were out of it. So I got some cocoa with because I was out. This is so good. It's so good on acai bowls or even on matcha coffee. And then I ended up getting these. It's the same brand of acai that I usually get. It's the Sambazon Acai Sorbet, but it's a sorbet, so it's just a scoop. I used to use the scoop. If you guys followed my other What I Eat In A Days in LA, I'd get like the big Brazilian one. So I'm excited to try it. Maybe it's even better, but they're out of the packets. So I ended up getting these. My serotonin levels are about to be so high because I just got my Starbucks. And I'm going to get these nails fixed. Um, Mm. I haven't had my nails done. Uh, I guess it's probably been two weeks or so, maybe a little over two weeks since I got my nails done, but um, they held up pretty well, just chips a little bit. It's almost six, so this is like the perfect little pick me up until dinner later, but I just wanted to make the announcement that my seat warmer is on. Can you see it? Where is it? It's like right over there. <sighs> seat warmers make me happy, like honestly. I did use them in LA, especially when I lived in the valley. I did use them because it would get a little bit chillier sometimes, but um, it is 
the happy happy day I got my flannel on feeling cozy I like still have my purse on right now because I didn't feel like taking it off because Starbucks this Starbucks is pretty close to my house so it was like a short drive but I don't know what I'm gonna do for my nails today um, I was looking at some pictures on Pinterest I usually get my inspo on Pinterest for nails I'll just like look up cute nail designs but I've been very much into minimal nails but my nails are actually growing like these are my nails they usually break by now but they're growing i've got to stop by uh, my box really quick and get my pr packages and i've also got to return um some candles i bought that i just didn't like which i'm so shocked because i can usually pick my fragrances online and i'm good to go even though i haven't smelled them but this time they were just like a few of them were just not good so i've got to go return that and i'm the worst at returning things like i never return things i, I just don't like to return things so i'm gonna do that and pick up my pr boxes and then head to the nail salon morning everyone i am getting ready to go into of me right behind me i just parked and i'm going to be getting botox in my armpits i showed this like a year or two ago on ig i have an igtv about it but i forget it's a really long word and I just had a brain fart. Ever since I was a little kid, I always would just sweat for no reason, even when it was cold and it was really frustrating and really embarrassing. And I've tried all of the things over the counter, like to try for sweating and nothing works. I started doing Botox in my armpit maybe like a year, two years ago, and it has changed my life. It is so worth it for me. I also use natural deodorant. So using natural deodorant plus sweating a lot is just it's just a no it's just a no for me so it has really changed my life I highly highly recommend it it just slows down your sweat gland so you don't sweat profusely and it is amazing so I'm gonna go see Amber and we're gonna go get it done and yes I'm wearing the same outfit as yesterday because I want to film a YouTube video today like a, a different video in this outfit because it's so cute I only got to wear it for like two hours I didn't want to waste it so I'm wearing like the same outfit today We just finished and it was really fast. We I was trying to vlog after I got my underarms done and then my camera died and then I got sidetracked and I've been doing a lot of emailing and then I just finished filming a video which I'm really excited about. It might already be up by the time this vlog goes up. Um, but I just wanted to update you guys on my armpits. It sounds so weird to say like that, but it didn't hurt. Amber was really quick. I'm about to finish drinking my coffee. I made like this big, hot, warm cup of coffee um, while I was sitting down and I filmed on my patio today. It was really nice. I'm gonna turn on the fire pit a little bit later, but I realized um, two things. One thing I wanted to update you on my arms. So I did an IGTV video on this. It's for hyperhidrosis. I've always sweat under my arms since I was a little kid. It's super annoying, and I this is my third time doing it. I started doing it, I you have to check my IGTV, but I documented the first time I did it in LA, and it changed my life, it was great. So I highly recommend it, and it doesn't hurt. I think lip filler hurts a lot more. Some of the like spots feel like a little pinch, but it's like not even a second, and you're good. So definitely recommend if you're thinking about it. It is an investment, but to me it's worth it because I don't like sweating all the time, it's gross. Second thing is I forgot to show you my nails. I did not show you what I did to my nails. So this is what we ended up doing. I just did kind of like an abstract, she just kind of freehanded. And then we did these two fingers on this hand. I just, I love having different designs on both nails. So my nails are growing long, you guys. Like, y'all, my nails are getting so long. I'm so happy about it. Being a perfectionist, the abstract thing, I've been wanting like a minimalist abstract nails. It threw me off at first because I'm used to like the designs being perfect, but it's growing on me. I just uploaded a new video, my beauty favorites, and um, I'm going to chill the rest of the night. I haven't eaten since this morning because I've just been busy working, so I've only had my coffee. Someone had to come fix the fireplace because it's been messing up, and it turns out the whole thing was installed wrong, so that was kind of scary. Last Friday, we turned on the fireplace and the carbon monoxide warning kept going off, and I was like, this cannot be good. So they fixed that today, which is awesome. I'm gonna light up the fireplace inside tonight it makes me feel so cozy but i am actually really tired i've been like go 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 all day today oh last thing i want to show you guys i got some questions on my instagram because i showed my little acupressure mat so that's what it looks like i got it on amazon it was only like 20 bucks and this is for body tension 
So it has like these little prickly like things. If you've ever done acupuncture, it's kind of like acupuncture. But I have it out here because in the mornings I like to lay on it for 15, 20 minutes. And it just helps if my back's hurting when I wake up. My lower back's been hurting a lot when I wake up. So it just helps relieve all the tension. It's kind of like acupuncture, but obviously it's not a needle going into your body. But I love acupuncture. So this has been really helpful. I kind of want to get, they have a more expensive one that's 60 bucks. I think it's more heavy duty. But I wanted to start with the $20 one and I really like it. I notice like a huge difference once I get off. It just feels like a rush over my whole body. And I highly recommend it if you have body pain. Um, or tension, it, it'll help you out a lot, at least help me out a lot. Literally overnight, the tree above my studio turned like a yellowish orange and it keeps getting darker. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited. So we're getting ready to go to this place. It's like some kind of bar with arcade games and bowling or something. I don't know. I got ready in like 15 minutes. I did like supernatural lip pencil, hair up, my bun is my go-to. I might do a tutorial on it because it's so easy. Mm -hmm. 